Time now for the most fun part of the show called the Style Files. I'm going to ask you a few questions and Lisa, you have to give me quick spontaneous answers. Okay. So are you ready? Ready. Lisa Hayden, the actor, or Lisa Hayden, the supermodel? Oh, I like both. Okay. Can I just pick both? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sure, why not? The ultimate style icon. Kate Moss, Kate Hudson. I love Kate Hudson. She's so spontaneous and fun and lively and she smiles all the time. And humorous, yes. Yeah, I think She's that adorable. makes her look amazing. Your last minute beauty fix? A GHD hair iron. Great. I think it just fixes a bad hair day in like yes. two minutes. I only wish they would have one with batteries. Yeah, so you can put you it into your handbag like, oh, and yeah. when you're in human places, it's your hair up. <laughs> I've got a meeting. <laughs> I read that apparently you just take 45 minutes to get ready. So break those 45 minutes down for us. I take about five minutes at home. I'm not kidding. But when I come out professionally, like today, I take 45 minutes. My lovely makeup artist, Lovely, she gives me a lovely face massage first, <laughs> all around my eyebrows and eyes and here, and she puts cream and moisturizes basically, because moisturizing is the first step. We always try and keep it simple. We try not to do too much unless it's required. Yeah, less is more. Dress up or dress down? Uh, well, for a red carpet, I think it's really important to dress up and to look elegant and beautiful and to, you know, look the part. But on the other hand, I don't like to dress up too much or be too stiff or feel uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. I think it's really important to just feel comfortable in whatever you're wearing and wear heels that aren't too high and dresses that, you know, how to go to the bathroom in without, you know, freaking out. Um, you know, just keeping it all in a way that you still feel like yourself inside. One thing you hate about photo shoots? Getting touched up. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> the worst fashion faux pas. I can't think of any specific moments right now and I want to call out any particular outfits because I'm sure those designers make wonderful things. But just wearing something that wasn't your particular mood or you know, doing hair and makeup that didn't suit you. Or you didn't feel 100%. Yeah, but you don't feel 100% yourself. Your latest high fashion splurge. I bought, oh, I bought a nice YSL handbag recently. I had the nice monogram and the tassels hanging off of it. Great. Yeah. Your fashion fetish? I think I buy shoes and bags in equal measure. I try not to be too extravagant on anything, um, but I like to buy one big bag a year and one little bag a year. In one word, describe the style caution of following. Ranbir Singh? Retro. Ranbir Kapoor? I actually don't know what he wears, but he's very dapper. Akshay Kumar? Rugged. Yes. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to take that from you in your first episode. Kangana? Uh, she's very experimental. I love, I love, I love when she wears those like glasses. And I think I saw her in a really cool Vivian Westwood outfit once and I thought, well done, girl. Deepika? And she's very elegant, isn't she? Very, she is. Yeah, she's very like um, proper, I find. I never see her trying anything too like out of the ordinary. Yeah, she but has she's that. very elegant. You did your first commercial with Rizik and the latest film with Akshay. So who's hotter? Akshay is an amazing person, you know. He's he's one of the funniest people I know. He really keeps us all laughing. And I find Rizik is so positive. We always talk about really positive things and rising above. <laughs> They're both really cool. Well put mm. together, Miss Hayden. <laughs> I mean, how embarrassed will I be if I meet them next time and I said something really Yeah, silly? and honestly, they both are hot. A Hollywood actor, you would love to do an intimate scene with. I don't think I've actually ever thought about that and, and if I did I wouldn't want to do it like on camera. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like, I don't know doing it on camera. <laughs> the wackiest thing that you've ever done. Oh I pierced my belly button when I was 13. With or without your parents? Oh permission? without. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. That was wacky then. I don't know why I did it but I just I think when you're rebellious and also yeah. I was really into dancing when I was younger and I yeah. think Shakira was like my my craze at that point in time and she was really into belly dancing and I It's also about your expression. You yeah. don't express yourself so that was my way of nice. expressing myself you are your sexiest best when I feel really good when I'm on the beach or when I've had a really good night's sleep and I wake up feeling like it's a holiday when you go in the sun mm -hmm. and then like at night when you go to dinner and your skin yeah. just has that one day of like that lovely like, carrot glow yeah and it feels kind yeah. of tropical I feel really good then I feel good after doing a headstand because all the blood rushes to your head and your mm -hmm. face looks really fresh after exercising or doing yoga three things in your wardrobe that you think are forever stylish I wear a lot of skinny jeans. I don't mm -hmm. think I'll ever really get over them. I love handbags that have long chains. You know, they kind of add a bit of a jewelry element to what you're wearing. Diamonds. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that is definitely an essential. Diamonds are a wardrobe <laughs> essential. <laughs> yes. What do you wear to bed? T-shirts. I thought you were going to say naked, and I mean your skincare. Oh, <laughs> with my skincare line on, I do wear that. I've been experimenting a bit with other products lately, but, um, but I do love using my naked stuff. Mm -hmm. 
my okay. naked stuff. That sounds really bad. <laughs> you are obsessive, compulsive about? Moisturizing. Mm. So you're like, I moisturize day and night. No matter what time you go to bed. I can't get out of the shower without moisturizing. I've got very dry skin and yes. I feel like a shower is not complete without it. Mm -hmm. One hidden talent you possess that not many people know about? I play guitar. Really? A little bit, yeah. Wow. Yeah. We should have got you a guitar to play a song or something. Oh, <laughs> next time. Next time. Okay. That was awesome, Lisa. You Thank were you. fabulous. Thank you.